Hi guys, this is me playing through Silent Hill. This is the first one for the PlayStation. It's running on EPSXA emulator. So yeah, I have my commentary. Won't be as, an as annoying as my Ten Crisis one, but yeah. Hope you enjoy. This is one of my favourite horror games ever made. It still scares me to this day. I love the atmosphere, the fog. Really well made. It's a classic. It's, I find this much better than some of the modern ones, which are all, oh, you've got hundreds of ammo and you've got a shotgun and armour. There's a wee guy on the radio saying, come on, Mr. Richards, let's go here, let's go there. So the loneliness has been taken away, the helplessness is taken away, and you've got fucking, you know, loads of guys that are just soldiers basically shooting at you. So scary. Yeah, he's a scary game, you know. Anybody that's played Fear and thinks it's scary should fuck off right now because you might have a heart attack watching this. Sherry? Pardon my language. Is that Sherry? Where are you going? Hey, wait! Stop! Nice girl. This is a totally innocent alleyway, nothing bad happened in here. This place is lovely, it's just nice and snowy, and people are just indoors because it's cold. There's nothing dodgy going on at all. That music playing is just a stock track. They ran out of Merry Christmas by Shake and Steven, you know. Merry Christmas, everyone. Wow, look at that. What the, what is it? It's a mess, that's what it is. This pitch really just sort of ain't taking all of this. Oh shit, oh no! This is kind of like me walking home drunk. You know, this brings back memories. Oh no, holy shit! Oh no, oh, oh god, oh god, oh! I still find this bit on the oven, really, the music's fantastic. What is this? What's going on here? No! No! No, you won't get me! No! You won't get me. Another thing is, when I first played this, I didn't know you were supposed to die here, so I was like... I wonder if they actually come down here. Oh shit, they do. No, I'm sorry. I guess it's time. I don't like this sort of parts like we have. Oh look, he just gets circumcised there. Do you see that? Right in the groin. <laughs> now I'm Jewish. <laughs> you bastards. <laughs> Mr. Anderson. Was I dreaming? How do you feel? Oh, I got been run over by a truck. But I'm alright, I guess. It's called a hangover. Deal with it. Glad to hear it. You from around here? Why don't you tell me what happened? Wait a second, I'm just a tourist. I came here for a vacation. I just got here. I don't know what happened. I'd like to find out myself. <clears throat> Have you seen a little girl? Just turned seven last month short black hair my daughter sorry the only person i've seen in this town is you where 
is everybody? I'd tell you if I knew, believe me. But from what I can tell, something bizarre is going on. That's all I know. Hmm. What's your name? Harry. Harry Mason. Sybil Bennett. I'm a police officer from Brams, the next town over. The phones are all dead, and the radio too. I'm going back to call in some reinforcements. Hmm. Hold it. Where do you think you're going? To his gym. My daughter. I've got to find her. No way. It's dangerous out there. In that case, I need to find her now. Cheryl's my little girl. I can't just leave her out there by herself. Pedo Bear's watching. Have you got a gun? What kind of gun? <laughs> um, no. Take this, and hope you don't have to use it. Now listen to me. Before you pull the trigger, know who you're shooting. And don't do it unless you have to. And don't go blasting me by mistake. Got it? Yeah, thanks. Do best to stay nearby. I'll be back with help as quick as I can. That is. We all know what you're thinking, boy. We all know what you're thinking. Hmm, what's this? I'll take this a health drink. Now, what is there? Ooh, another health drink and a jaggy knife. Yes, I'll take that. I'll take that as well. No, menu chain. Not the wrong one. <sighs> Equip. Okay. Hmm, let's examine this. Video? I can't hear anything. Now, when I first played this as a kid, this bit freaked me the fuck out. Maybe I should do something useful. Oh, I forgot the map. Oh, I'm over it. I thought it was just deco. Yes, I'll take the residential area map. Oh no, I don't like that. Something's outside. Here we go, gentlemen. What's that? Huh. Radio. What's going on with that radio? The radio is broken. to this place. That music's so freaky. It's a pocket radio, will you take it? Anyone who's played Fallout 3 you'll be half expecting, yay, 3 da Galaxy News Radio! But no, it doesn't happen, sadly. <clears throat> okay, let's go back to the alley then. Sounds good to me. Okay, we're at the cafe, so we go down this way. Let's go. Oh, almost forgot. Handgun ammo. Yes, please. Yes, please. Now, let's reload my weapon. Off to see the wizard, the wonderful wizard of Oz. Off to see the wizard, the wonderful wizard of Oz. Dum 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 dum. Wait, am I going the right way? I must be, cause it's a scary monster. Okay. 
Oh, I heard that apparently his accuracy is better if you hold the lock on for the enemies longer. I'm not sure because it never seemed to work for me. Okay, whatever. That's bullshit again. Kidding me the fuck up! Jesus Christ. You know, last time I played this, I didn't have this problem once. The first time I played in this playthrough, it fucking happens at the very start of the game. What the fuck? Okay. Uh, there's a dog around here somewhere. Yeah, it's that is right. Now to reload my weapon. Good thing I'm playing this on easy because there's plenty of ammo. I'll be totally screwed by now. Okay, let's go. Let's find my daughter. Run through here. The handgun ammo. Certainly going to need it if those things are fucking you around. Now, back up the iron pipe. Cool. Now examine this sort of stuff here. To school. <laughs> She's at the school, how nice. Hey guys, I'm in, a, I'm in a horrible, horrible, scary town. Where should I go? The school. Smart move. Anyhow, this is the end of part one. Hope you've enjoyed it. Be prepared for part two.